This is a warm up with explanation. I think it's always important to understand what we're trying to achieve with our exercises and not just exercise for warming up. But we do need to sometimes, we just need to warm up if we've got something that we're doing or we want to be ready for our next lesson. So you will have both. This is the video with explanation and you will have an audio without so you don't have to hear me talking. Um, so the exercise is going to be this. And it's on Z. Z. What are we going for? We're going for flow, airflow, ease of singing. The vocal tract, remember, is the space through which the sound travels and your sound starts in your larynx. And we've got all this great space, the laryngeal space and the pharyngeal space in the back. But we also need it to move forward. All styles, all genres need that clarity. Opera, musical theater, pop, rock. But you do not want to grab and hurt yourself. At the same time, we need our mix to be aces. We need it to be so strong. And that's the range between, I guess I would say D to A, and it depends on your vocal range. Look, I know for our, our really knowledgeable singers, you if you know this part, then you know where your mix starts. But in general, there is about a five note radius in which we have our mix and we have to strengthen it. People call it the break, okay? but it's not just in that one area. It's actually throughout your entire range. As you go higher, there's another break. Um, it's not the mix mix, but there are those areas that you do have to recalibrate, let's say, to make sure that it stays strong and that your voice stays as one unit. We don't break the voice up into different parts because it's not, it's a muscle, it's mucous membranes that just connects and gets stronger uh, and more powerful, right? So keep the mix strong, Focus on it. Don't run from it. Let's practice. Did I already tell you you were going to get the audio without me talking? Okay, just make it sure. Z. And that's okay. I totally cracked, right? That's okay. I probably didn't really concentrate enough on my muscles and I really want it to flow. So I'm going to focus on those vibrations that allow it to move forward, but I'm not, I'm going to avoid any pushing muscular if you see veins popping out bro stop okay that means you're pushing somewhere that shouldn't be pushed this area we don't want to push we want it to be relaxed so that it looks easy when we sing let's do it again space crouch obliques transverses open them up z z A minor instead of major. Z. 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 If you got through that and it starts to feel easy, you are on the right path. You just want to feel those sensations go and just movement, airflow, okay? If the exercise goes too high or too low for your comfort level, 
Remember, you can always drop the octave or raise it up and continue on with the exercise. That being said, please don't discourage yourself. Be careful what you say to yourself, especially in, where, in the areas of which you think something is too low or too high. Remember, this is a vocal exercise. You need to stretch yourself in order to expand your range and in order for these muscles to grow and become stronger. And that comes with maybe going out of our comfort level and letting it crack. Oh my gosh. So what? It's a warm up. And you can probably work through it. So go through the low lows, go through the high highs. If it hurts, you're doing something that needs to be addressed. Stop. Don't continue on. Readdress your technique. Space, relax, oblique, crunch. You've got this. I can't wait to see you in the next video. Talk to you later.